What's going on guys? Danny Lanier Lawn Care. Today I'm going to tell you how this stupid stick cost me two hours of work and it's something I would have never thought would have happened. Uh, i never seen it happen. I've never heard of it happening. Uh, I'm not saying that it's not happened, but I'm going to tell you what happened to me. Before we get into this, I want to tell you about Jobber, okay? Listen, if you haven't, I'm going to go through some comments from other people and I just, I, two of you, please, two people, go try it this month. Two people, go try it next month. Whatever. Two people, do me a favor, go try the free trial. The link's down below. Go check it out. See if it's something that's right for you because I'm going to tell you that I've never, my, my clients love it. They absolutely love it. I, everybody has went from paying from check to other things that I've used that they tried paying with their card, didn't like it. Now, I can't get people to not pay with their card. I'm gonna tell you the best uh, thing about it as well is there's a tip option and I've never got so many tips in my life. Uh, it's amazing that when you give people the option to tip on the invoice there, how many people do it? So anyway, uh, you probably get enough in tips to pay for, you know, the CRM software itself. Uh, but let's go through some, some uh, things real quick of other people tell you exactly how they feel about Jobber. Okay, just real quick. And then I'm going to tell you about how this stick uh, just killed my whole day. Uh, well, it killed about two hours of my time. You probably can't even see this. But uh, this guy says, I've, I've deleted the, you know, marked out the names and everything. So uh, hopefully you can see it. Maybe if I move out of the way, you can see it. Absolutely love it. Very few complaints. If any at all, my clients love it. I love it and so do my employees. Uh, this guy says, love it. No complaints. This guy used a different software that I blurred out. Uh, Jobber is way better. I used whatever it was for like three to four years. Then a few years ago, switched to Jobber and like it a lot better. So do all the customers. Never had a complaint. Yes, switching to Jobber was the best thing I did. Easy to use and clients like their hub. Let me tell you, if you've not tried this software, it's free to just click the link below and go try. Let's go to some more here. So this biggest thing, uh, I'm gonna read you this here. This guy says, I've seen several posts recently about guys switching software programs. I've used several different CRMs for my lawn care business from the free ones to the more expensive ones. My recommendation for most guys or people would be Jobber. For starters, it's a pretty modern solution. It's great for field use. If you're still on the truck, mowing lawns, it's simple to pull up whatever information you would need right from your phone without having to carry along a laptop. Modern software like Jobber also means that anything you send to your inbound leads will look professional and designed to look good on all screen sizes. Not stuck in the dinosaur era like some softwares out there. Scheduling jobs is simple. The, they have easy job routing features to help reduce wasted drive time. Billing is easy and allow for customer credit card payments. But the reason why I recommend it for most people is for two reasons, cost and scalability. When you need extra features like automated email and text follow-ups, advanced routing and marketing integrations, it's there when you're ready. Guys, if that's not, Plenty of reasons for you to even give this a try for free. Well, I don't know what is. So, uh, once again, go try it out. See if it's something that's right for you. It's winter time. Now's the time that if you ain't doing nothing, even if you are, you're down south and you're still mowing, doing whatever, uh, you can still try this for free. Just click the link, sign up, free trial, run through it, see if it's things that you even like. Maybe it's not for you, uh, but it's for a lot of people and a lot of people don't lie. So back to this stick thing. So I'm, uh, I'm doing my last mows of the season and, uh, you know, literally leaves everywhere and blah, blah, blah. But anyway, 
This stick caused me so much heartache. I'm gonna show you this here. Look at this. Can you see that? Um, look at that. So yeah, you wanna talk about craziness. This is where, look at that. Uh, see if you can see it this way, maybe. You can tell, uh, but this is where the belt, the hydro belt at that. So somehow or another, I ran over this stick, uh, never seen it in the lawn, but it got jammed up the, on the Ferris mower here. It got jammed up and it threw the belt uh, off and it was stuck like, kind of like this, I guess. And the belt just kept rubbing this. And I'm like, <clears throat> my left hydro went completely out and I'm like, why can't I move? And then smoke started rolling and I'm like, I shut it down. And I got to looking and this stick had jammed up in there through the, the belt. Uh, well, the belt was, you know, running on this. <clears throat> so I got the stick out, but it threw the, uh, threw the hydro belt off. Guys, let me tell you, getting this hydro belt on this Ferris was not fun. Uh, from, cause it's so heavy of a machine, even if you unlock the hydros that, uh, I, I couldn't, I couldn't get it on my trailer um, to get it to a dealer. Uh, so I had to fix this on site and just learn. So I did get it fixed with the help of, uh, well, Daryl Vaughn was up the street from Vaughn's Lawns. And so I messaged him, he came down, you know, helped me out and uh, he left me some tools and I did get it back on. But uh, I actually, I actually didn't get it back on, but I, I called uh, my dealer and, uh, well, I called a guy at the dealer and um, he came out on his lunch break and actually put it back on for me. So thank gosh for people like that because let me tell you, dealer support, huge. Uh, this guy on his lunch break came and helped me. So anyway, uh, sticks. <laughs> For you people that run over sticks, this was a huge lesson for me because usually I don't run over sticks. I usually try to pick them up. And uh, well, this one I didn't see in the lawn and the grass. And it, well, it it got me, it got me good. And I never thought that something like that could happen until it happened. So, you know, eight years, nine years in doing this and man, you still are learning things to this day. It's absolutely crazy that we think we know everything and then something pops up and uh, you find out real quick, this is not something I ever imagined happening whatsoever. So anyway, that's how uh, this little stick cost me uh, lots of downtime, but with how easy, you know, jobber is. <laughs> it saved me so much time as well. So anyway, uh, guys, Thanks for watching. I've got plenty of videos coming out for you. I am going to, uh, I've got this new Milwaukee radio that I'm going to uh, do a review of again, even though I've already done it. I've got the new oscillating, uh, well, the new little, here you go, right here. Got the, uh, got that. Yeah, the new rotary tool. So we'll tell you about that because it's pretty phenomenal compared to the old one. Now I've got the old one too, but you know, now I've got the new one as well. So I'm going to tell you some differences of between those two. Anyway, thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Once again, it's just two of you, please. Uh, three of you, whatever. Uh, go click the link below and just give, see if it's something to try for you. And here's what I want you to do. If you don't like it, I want you to comment on this video what you don't like about it or what you do like about it. But I want you to actually give it a chance before you just jump into it and go, eh, okay, well, I gave it five minutes. It's not how anything works and you know it. So thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I'm Danny. We'll see you in the next one. Let's go. I'm a strap in the great, yep. knock with the bass. Yep. I got the echo locked in your face. Ooh. If you want to battle, this is not that place. You can meet me at the table and come get a taste. We talk to YouTube live, yep. where I thrive. Yep. See me on the tour, watch the grass fly by. Some think that I'm cocky, DeWalt to Milwaukee. It really don't matter, cause y'all can get off me. If you like the video, sub, then hit a play. We got 10K.